In this video, we'll take a look at what 3D or three-dimensional tic-tac-toe is. That's the game Cowgirl Wendy and Cowboy Shawn were playing in the previous video. Let's start real quick though with the review of two-dimensional tic-tac-toe. You've probably played this game before. It starts with a three by three grid. The goal is to get either three X's or three O's in a row. If a player is able to get either three X's or three O's in a row, then that player wins. 3D Tic-Tac-Toe has the same goal, get three of your symbols in a row. However, the game board is three-dimensional. Here's a physical model I found online. You can see how it's three different three by three grids, giving a total of 27 places you can place your symbols. And what we're seeing here is a number of configurations of three in a row. Notice how some of them, the early ones, were all within one plane, but the later ones are passing through all planes three-dimensionally. Now, I don't have one of those fancy 3D games, but we can play three-dimensionally kinda with a grid like this. I say kinda because it's really two-dimensional, but you can visualize it as three dimensions. Let's take a look at some of the 3D puzzle solutions we just saw on this 2D grid. Remember this one here? That would look like this on our 2D grid. Actually, this one by itself is two dimensional because it doesn't use the other two planes. Let's look at one that does. All right, this one's a fun one. This one goes through all three planes vertically three in a row. That would look like this. Let's do one more using the stacked 2D grids. This one's super fun. Not only does it go through all three planes, it goes diagonally. And that one would look like this. <laughs> now, I know what some of you might be thinking. When you saw Cowgirl Wendy and Cowboy Sean playing, they weren't playing on a grid that looked like this. They were playing on a grid that looked like this. Well, I guess technically they looked like this. In the next video, we'll walk through Wendy and Sean's game and see how Wendy won.